everyone, this is Melissa from Trendline. In this video, I'll take you through how to get started with using some of the platform's features. Let's see how you can add metrics in the My Metrics section. You can access the My Metrics option in two ways, the custom metrics and default metrics or stock overview metrics. To access the My Metrics section through custom metrics, hover over screener in the top navigation bar and click on My Parameters list. The My Metrics list displays a list of parameters of a user's choice. Metrics one set can be loaded from any table. To add new metrics, click on Add New Metric list as shown here. The next step is to name your list and then select metrics from the options in the dropdown. Once you are ready with the metric list, click on Done. You will then be able to see your metric list ready to be loaded from any table. To access the My Metrics section through default metrics, go to the Key Metrics section on a Stock Overview page. To customize the stock overview page, click on Manage Metrics and use Select Metric to choose your preferred options. You can add up to 60 metrics to suit your needs. Click on Done once you have added the metrics. You will then see these on the overview page for your selected stock and across other stock overview pages. You can also see these stock overview metrics across other sections like Watchlist and Screener under the My Metrics dropdown. Next, let's take a look at the Forecaster or Analyst Estimates dashboard available on the platform. Trendline's Forecaster and Analyst Estimates dashboard offers a complete view of earnings estimates from institutional analysts for approximately 900 companies. Analyst estimates don't cover the entire stock universe since not all companies are tracked by the institutional analysts. Generally, analysts focus on larger companies rather than smaller ones since the top 500 companies represent 95% of the market cap in the stock exchanges. These estimates are updated on a quarterly and annual basis as analyst calls come in. The dashboard provides estimates of target prices, EPS, earnings per share, revenue, profits, CAPEX, dividend, consensus recommendations, etc. from different analysts for various stocks. To access the forecaster or analyst estimates dashboard on Trendline, hover over the markets tab in the top navigation bar and click on analyst estimates. Alternatively, click on forecaster dashboard in the forecaster section of a stock page. The Forecaster dashboard offers detailed estimates from analysts on several metrics, including target prices, revenue, profit, EPS, dividends, cash flows, and more. Here, you can identify companies with high bullishness or bearishness and those with the highest forward 12-month upside. Filters for the highest or lowest annual EPS growth and revenue growth provide consensus estimates for companies' expected earnings per share and annual revenue growth. Similarly, you can see companies with the highest 3-month upsides, annual CAPEX growth, and annual dividend per share. Trendline's Forecaster dashboard also allows you to select and customize the range of parameters for your analysis. To do this, select a parameter from the drop-down, then choose the condition above or below, and the value. Set your preferred values in Stock Universe. Finally, click on Submit to see which stocks have satisfied the set criteria. Next, let's see how you can access the report section. As a Trendline user and subscriber, you can find stock, sector, and IPO reports from leading brokerages in the report section. Note that these are retail research reports from brokerage analysts, different from calls made by institutional analysts in Forecaster. To access the report section, simply click on Reports in the top navigation bar. Here, you can search for reports by stock by using the search bar. You can also filter by broker here to see reports by a specific broker. You also have the option to choose between various indices, sectors, industries, watch lists, or portfolio. You can also set up alerts for new reports for stocks in your watch list and or portfolio through Alpha Alerts. This way you will receive alerts through email when a new report on your interested stocks is available on Trendline. In the report section, you will also find other tabs such as highest upside, buy, sell, IPO, etc. Suppose you want to view reports on highest upside stocks, you will find those under the highest upside tab. Similarly, you can see reports with buy or sell ratings by brokerages by clicking on the respective tabs. This video has covered my metrics, viewing the Forecaster dashboard and report section on the platform. You can find detailed videos for the Forecaster feature on our channel. Now head over to Trendline.com and make the most of what it offers. Thanks for tuning in. This is Melissa signing off.